Edge computing comes with the challenge of scale. And so when we think about edge computing, it's really about scaling your people. It's about scaling your operations and how do you maintain centralized control and visibility and manageability in a way that allows the business to scale as well. So imagine in a manufacturing environment, you've got a lot of different plants located perhaps all over the country. Perhaps you're building bikes and you're making sure that the wheels are perfectly circular. If for any reason there is drift in that manufacturing process, you can quickly process the fact that that is happening and stop manufacturing. And so what that does to a business is they don't have to waste a lot of material. It's really about helping solve things at the place where that thing is happening. Look at this. You're not gonna believe this manufacturing error. Bicycles around the world are spontaneously collapsing. A screw used in production was manufactured too small. At Red Hat, we did this really cool video where we try to bring this use case to life a little bit more. Wow, they really screwed up. It is put in a Sorry. quite satirical type of way, but it could happen. And these are the types of things that we want to address and help solve for with Red Hat OpenShift. At Red Hat, we have what are called Red Hat Edge Validated Patterns. And what they do is they architect a whole edge stack that then a technology partner can add their specific capabilities to, to address specific use cases. So these are validated, they're tested, they are lifecycle managed, which means that if a product within the validated pattern gets updated, the validated pattern itself gets updated. So what this does to the business is it helps minimize risk, it helps you get from zero to POC, as we say, a lot faster, and ultimately helps you build an edge architecture that is specific to you and is not something that is generic and it's something that you can use as an organization.